Okay, so uh, I just want to address this uh, very famous saying, the ball flight does not lie. Uh, true or false? Well, yes, more or less true, because uh, once we know that, uh, you know, the ball starts more or less in the direction of the face and then curves away from the path, uh, we can look at a ball flight and we can, we can try and make our assessment to say, yes, the ball started 70, 80%, 90% towards the face and then moved away from the path. And we can more or less know our face was right, our path was even more right of the face, whatever that inference may be. But there is one important ingredient that we must not forget here. And that is the point of contact because that influences gear effect and that influences where the ball is going to start and where the ball is going to curve in the air sometimes and a lot of times much more than what the face and path does so i've had this incidents with me many times where we had some really good players and they're hitting their the ball's actually starting right and drawing starting just right of target and drawing and they think that they're making a very good draw swing but actually they're making a fade swing because i can tell you that there's so much gear effect in modern day clubs specifically your driver three wood and your hybrid there's so much gear effect that you may make you may make a perfect fade swing, but if you miss hit the ball by about one centimeter, one centimeter, you miss hit it to the toe, your ball is actually going to start right and just drop. You may have made a perfect fade swing, but the ball is going to start right and draw if you miss hit it by one centimeter. One centimeter is about 12 to 13 millimeters, and all of us miss hit it by that much. So, my advice to everybody, players, enthusiasts, instructors, always have a pen. This is a glass marker pen and all, all you want to do is, specifically when you hit your driver three wood hybrid, all you want to do is you want to make sure that you color this pen. There you go, I can see that I've colored it. And now, when you hit the shot, you will actually have the imprint of the golf ball here and you will know where you hit it from. The ball, the ball flight can only be inferred on the starting direction and the curved direction and you can actually infer where the face and path were only if it's a center contact if it's not a center contact you cannot because your face and path may be of a perfect fade but if you miss hit it a little bit on the toe the ball can only draw the ball cannot fade